Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back. I hope you all are doing really well. In today's video, I wanted to share with you my full Skims collection. My collection is predominantly the cotton and fits everybody. So those are the two collections that I'm gonna be sharing throughout this video. I've been wanting to do this video for a while now. You guys are always asking me about Skims and what my favorite bras and underwear are. So I'm so excited to share everything with you. But also, I can't believe that these words are actually gonna come out of my mouth right now. I wanna thank Skims for partnering with me on today's video. I've been obsessed with skims since they launched the cotton collection 1.0 back in 2019 i believe and since then i've accumulated well over 60 pieces wow so this is an absolute pinch me moment thank you so much skims all right let's go ahead and get into it we have a lot to cover and i want to make sure that i'm touching on sizing how to wash how to style and just details on each piece too let's start with the cotton collection first specifically the undergarments where my love began is with the dipped thong really if we want to blame anything for my obsession we have to blame the dipped thong <laughs> this is my everyday underwear this style of thong is just my absolute favorite it has really good coverage in the front and in the back it is their classic dipped front panty style they also have the dipped thong in the fits collection which i'll share with you guys in a little bit but this cotton is on another level. It's just so soft and so stretchy and it's a little bit thinner than the Cotton Collection 1.0, which I actually prefer. This isn't an underwear that I have to fuss with. It just stays in place. It doesn't dig into my hips. This is one of the thongs that I wear under activewear and I don't have an issue with it showing either. So as you can see, I have this in like every single color and multiples of each color too. This is just one of each because I wanted to be able to show you guys what the colors look like in person. There's a lot of the core collection in here, like the bone in the suit, meaning that these are always available and always restocking. But then I also have a few of like the seasonal colors in here, like garnet and deep sea and stuff like that. But really it doesn't even matter what color you get it in. It is just that good. And for sizing, let's touch on sizing. So I am an extra small in this thong for the Cotton Collection 1.0. I was actually a size small. The Cotton Collection 1.0 ran extremely small. But honestly, for sizing in general, I feel like at the beginning skims was kind of all over the place when it came to sizing like i was a small in the cotton collection and an extra extra small in the fits everybody collection but since they first came out skims has definitely figured it out my sizing is pretty consistent throughout all of the collections it's just a really rare cases that i would go from an extra small to an extra extra small and vice versa but really i am an extra small in everything that Skims has. Next up is the cotton rib thong. This one's been out for a while, but it's a newer addition to my collection. I've always been curious of this, so I picked it up and I'm really glad I did. This is not a style that I had in my collection previously. So this is a high cut thong with a very minimal back. It's kind of like a T-strap back. The waistband on this, you guys, it is so soft and not constricting at all. It kind of just sits there and it doesn't dig in. For sizing on this one, this is one of those rare cases, I think because of the style of it and the ribs material on it in particular I had a size down to a size extra extra small in this and it looks super cute paired with the plunge bralette that I'm going to share in a little bit or like the rib tank too as you'll see I love having matching sets in all my undergarments of having my bras and my underwears match or even having my undergarments match just like my normal clothing too it really just feels like I have my shit together <laughs> ah the cheeky tanga thank you so much skins for releasing this style so I have this one in pretty much all of the colors too and I have multiples of these ones as well This is my go-to night underwear and I know that sounds really weird to have a specific underwear that you like to sleep in But I do I'm extremely picky with my underwear They have to just feel and fit a certain way to sleep in I don't know what that is, but it's a thing and these ones just have an amazing soft cotton They're stretchy. They're breathable. Just really comfy overall. These do have a cheeky back to them and to be honest they sometimes ride up a little bit but not enough that it bothers me it is a high-rise cut and it sits I would say at my belly button but the nice thing about this is that it can be adjusted to sit a little bit lower too but I just love the high cut on it it makes my legs just look extremely long and I'm petite so I obviously will take anything to give the appearance of making me look taller but overall I just feel like these take a really simple basic underwear and elevates it to make it look like I 
have a super sexy pair of underwear on. I don't know how Kim does it. I swear she's a genius. So next up, I do have one pair of the boy shorts. This one is actually in a size small. This is when the cotton collection, I guess 2.0 came out. And I thought that my size would still be a size small, just like the 1.0 collection. But this is when they made that amazing adjustment to line up their sizing with the rest of their collections. So it would have actually been an extra small, but honestly with the size small in this, I'm not complaining at all. It's wild to me that you can still size up in this and it would be totally fine, especially in the boy short. It's just really comfortable to sleep in. These are high waisted and they don't ride up at all, which is really nice, but the front can roll a little bit. If you like boy shorts and cotton underwear, you really can't go wrong with these at all. The band is not tight. I find that I love to wear these under shirt dresses or oversized tees just to lounge in around the house to sleep in, really just anything at all. Okay, so heading into a few of the bras and bralettes that I have from the Cotton Collection. Collection. So this is the first one, which is the plunge bra that I was speaking to earlier that would look really good with the ribbed thong. You can see specifically on this one that it has thicker straps in comparison to the other bralettes that Skims offers. This is a really thick material and even in this color, it is not see-through at all. There's no padding in this bra, but what you will see is that it is double lined, but on the other side, it has kind of like this power mesh material, which I find actually helps the hold and the supports. I obviously have a larger cup size and I was really worried that it'd be falling out of this or I wouldn't get the support that I needed, but that's not the case at all from this. And I think that is due to the mesh interior along with this underband. This underband is extremely soft and it's really tight, but not like overly tight. I'm honestly just shocked that my girls are not moving at all in this bra. It has them very well under control. The plunge is so cute too, because it definitely has has like a sexier vibe to it while still being super casual. So next up is the triangle bralette. The construction of this one is really similar to the plunge bralette. This one as well is lined with this power mesh that helps the coverage and just like really lifting up the girls. Again, I find that triangle bralettes never seem to really work for me. I feel like they're better suited for those with smaller cup sizes, but I actually really like this one. It really keeps me in. It is so soft. This is an excellent bra for every day or for lounge and it's definitely in my bralette rotation. Next up is the underwire bra. You guys have heard me speak about this one before. I love underwire bras compared to wireless bras because at least on me, they don't move. And this one in particular is obviously the same cotton fabric as the rest of the line. So it's oh so soft and so comfy. It just really forms to your body. It is double lined. The coverage on this one is a little bit more minimal in comparison to say the Fits Unlined bra, which is another bra that I'll share with you guys in a second. But again, I feel like I still get the support and the comfort from this bra, which is why it's a part of my bra rotation. Any bra that you can just put on and then forget about all day and you don't need to like fuss with and adjust and everything, that is a winner in my book. I am a 32D throughout and in Skims, there's no difference in that. I order 32D in all my bras from Skims and it's a perfect fit for me. Okay, so moving more into the clothing aspect, let's get into my latest obsession, which has been Skims t-shirts and tank tops. If you guys have been a longtime subscriber of mine, you already know what is coming. All of these, I think actually I've shared in my 15 of the best t-shirts and tanks video that I posted about three to four months ago. I'll definitely link it in case you missed it, but these t-shirts, you guys, you need in your life. I'll start with the t-shirt bodysuit. I do have it in two colors. I just have it in suit and in bone. These are staple pieces that every single person needs in their wardrobe. This is a piece that can be worn on its own or to be a base layer too. So if you wanna throw a cardigan or a shirt jacket or anything over top, maybe even a sweater vest, that would be really Really cute too. But let's talk about this fabric. This fabric is so difficult to try to explain. It just feels like the next and better generation of a cotton tee. It's really stretchy and it's breathable, yet it like curves to your body and holds and sucks you in. What kind of magic is this, honestly? You can see that the tee kind of like cinches in at the waist. So that's how it kind of just conforms to your body a little bit more. And then this is a thong bodysuit with a snap closure which is just a necessity for me in bodysuits. It doesn't write up at all. It really just stays in place too. So this is definitely an item that I would pick 
pick up for the fall time, especially again for like the layering piece. It's gonna come in clutch in the colder weather when you wanna wear cardigans and shirt jackets, like I said, over top and just get the basic colors too. You're gonna pair this with absolutely everything. Next up is just the t-shirt version. So as you can see, it's just like the bodysuit, but just in a t-shirt form. So it still has like the curved silhouette to the t-shirt where it really just conforms to your body and makes it feel just like second skin. This is honestly the best cotton tee that you'll ever own. It's like a thicker, soft fabric that is stretchy, like I was saying, but it's not see-through at all. This t-shirt does hit at your hip, which is a really great length because I love to tuck this into jeans and have it act like the bodysuit, and it just doesn't move at all. It just stays completely tucked in. In the t-shirt, this collection is growing. I already have it in three colors. I actually saw that they came out with the long sleeve version of this, and I already picked that one up too in preparation for fall. Trying to get ahead before it goes out of stock because it definitely will go out of stock. Next up is the mock neck tee. Oh, where to begin with this? It's obviously the one that I'm wearing right now. This tank just has the perfect amount of coverage and the fit of it is just impeccable. I love like where it stops on the shoulders. It just has like a very fitted, sexy vibe to it that's so easy to dress up or down. I love that this is also a piece that I can wear to work because I'm gonna need to head back into the office in a couple of months. And to me, it just seems like a very classic top. It can be professional, definitely wear it with a blazer. But also, like I said, I think that you can easily dress this down like right now I'm wearing it with sweat shorts. I always pair this with sweatpants as well. Also like the top of this, the mock neck part is so surprisingly stretchy for me. I get ready first. I do my makeup and my hair and then I get dressed last and there's nothing worse than trying to get a top on and not mess up your hair and makeup. And this one doesn't mess up your hair or makeup at all. Obviously for summer, this is like the perfect tank top. You guys have seen me wear this a lot the last few months, but this is definitely a top that I'm gonna carry with me into fall too. So I definitely have this in like all of the colors as well, you guys. Skims coloring is just like chef's kiss, honestly. You can get this in just like the classic black or ivory color, which is bone or suit, but the colors, the tones of the colors, they are everything. Like the mineral, the deep sea, the garnet, this new light heather gray color that they came out with, it honestly doesn't even matter what color you get. All of the tones, are so on point and they are so amazing. I love every single color that Skims comes out with. Can't forget to throw in the cotton rib tank in this as well. This has been my go-to since day one, since Cotton Collection 1.0. This is another one that I have in literally all of the colors. This is a staple go-to tank, you guys. The silhouette of this is just unmatched. The front of it has a scoop neckline that is like a little bit more squared off, which I like. It has really thick strips Straps. The back of it is full coverage, just has the perfect crop length too. It hits right at your natural waist, so it looks really good with high-waisted jeans, leggings, sweatpants, any bottom. It's all around just my favorite basic tank top, but this is definitely one that I say runs true to size. I get these all in a size extra small, but you can definitely size up in these as well. Next up is the cotton rib boxer. These are like your boyfriend's boxers, but better. This elastic band at the top is really stretchy, but it helps to like cinch in your waist a little bit. It's not constricting at all. And I just love the ribbed material throughout. It's just really soft. It's really stretchy. This middle part right here is double lined, which I feel like is important because on the lighter colors of this that I'll actually share with you in a second, I have a similar pair in bone. The lighter colors do tend to get a little bit see-through. So I love that some aspect of this is double lined. What I love about these boxer shorts is that you don't have to wear them just for lounging purposes. Yes, they are amazing to sleep in. They're great to lounge around the house in, but you guys, these double as bike shorts. Just throw on an oversized hoodie, an oversized tee or anything like that and go out and about and it would look so good. So here's the cotton rib legging that I was mentioning that I have in bone. So these lighter colors are a little bit see-through. The darker ones, again, not so much. So I just keep that one in mind. This front panel, again, is double line that you'll see during like the try-on parts. But these leggings are just a staple for the fall time. Can you imagine me pairing this mock neck with these as well? Oh 
you guys see this is what i love about the tones and having matching sets if you just get the staple colors and everything you'll always have things going together and matching oh i love that so the top of these are just like the boxers they are high rise it has an elastic waistband that helps to like cinch you in the waistband is really soft too back to like the magic of this cotton this does hold you in yet it's stretchy too so it makes it really easy to just move around in and just lounge in i honestly don't know how they make this cotton so versatile like that the length of this is a little bit long for being petite but if i just roll the bottom cuff over once i feel like it looks just fine i don't have any concerns with it at all but i feel like similar to the bike shorts you can definitely throw an oversized hoodie on maybe even the rib take underneath and oh i love that that would look so good before i move on to the fits everybody collection i wanted to touch on how i wash my skin pieces i would say first and foremost definitely follow the care label on each of the pieces but when in doubt i always wash everything on delicate sometimes inside out never fabric softener and i never throw anything in the dryer i do lay things flat to dry if you want to like fluff something up after the fact after it's dried i would like maybe throw it in the dryer to like fluff it up a little bit to get some of like the stiffness out so with that being said let's go ahead and jump into the fits everybody collection the first thing i wanted to start out with is the scoop bralettes my ride or die i live and breathe for these bralettes that is not a joke <laughs> they're honestly just one of the best things that i've ever purchased and i wear these daily it's actually one of the bras that i'm wearing right now so as you can see it, it gives like a very seamless fit with a lot of like the tight tops this is always my go-to bra especially this last year during the pandemic and working from home that's when i originally discovered this was over a year ago at this point and this is the only thing i've been wearing the last year so if you ever have any question about what specific bra i'm always wearing it's these bralettes so of course i do have it in every single color some of them multiples like this top one that's one the one i'm wearing right now the color range on this is insane it not only has like the seasonal colors like this one i think is like a seasonal color but it has all of the colors to match like any skin tone too like these are a few from their skin tone range I just like getting all of them. I mean, depending on if I'm wearing something light colored like this, it's nice to wear the nude color. If I'm wearing like more brown, I love this one. This is actually a new addition that I just got a week ago. So I haven't worn it yet. But anyways, let's talk about this fabric for a second. So like I was mentioning, it is really buttery soft. It's a two ply supportive ultra stretch fabric fabric it gives a very seamless look these are so lightweight they are so stretchy but yet it just feels like you're not really wearing anything skims definitely nailed it with this fabric the underband on this is honestly the perfect level of support the straps are adjustable and i just love like the scoop front on this too i saw that the cotton collection came out with a version just like this so that's definitely something next on my list that I definitely need to get my hands on. Next up is the triangle bralette. So this is a nice switch up from the scoop bralette, especially depending on what sort of shirt that I'm wearing. If it is like a little bit more plunge, if you will. This has the exact same fit and feel as the scoop bra does. So it definitely feels like second skin. It's super soft. Even with this one, it doesn't feel like I'm just like spilling out of it. It really like holds and sucks me in. This is the version that you actually pull over your head. There is another version of this bralette, which I think is the crossover bralette. What it has like in the front of this, it's like a little crossover detail. But on that one, the back of this does have a hook and eye closure on it. So there are two different versions of this, which is really nice. Next up is the unlined underwire bra. So this is definitely one of like the more sexier bras that I own because it is like mesh and a little bit see-through too. I love the shape that this provides. It just really molds to your body, yet it's super comfortable and supportive. This one is more fuller coverage too. So this really does cover like your full boob in comparison to say the cotton underwire bra that I shared with you at the beginning of this video. And it honestly surprises me that even with it being full coverage, it doesn't feel like a granny bra bra or anything like I still feel super sexy in this bra and this mesh is really soft it's really breathable you just kind of like forget that you have it on next up I do have the t-shirt bra so this is not the push-up version it's just like the normal t-shirt bra this is my favorite structured bra that I own it's beat out all the other ones that I've had from other brands say like Victoria's Secret or from Nordstrom this one doesn't move it doesn't require adjusting throughout the day that's one of like my biggest pet peeves when it comes to like these structured bras
bras like this. This does have an underwire to it, but the cups of these and the fabric is just so soft. This is like more fuller coverage and it doesn't show lines through your shirt too. So if you are more of like the structured bra lover, I would definitely recommend this one. And I just stuck with my normal size of a 32D and that works perfectly for me. The fits everybody dipped thong is up next. This is honestly tied with the cotton collection dip thong. I, I can't pick one or the other. The cut of these is just so freaking flattering. I love the dip in the front. I love like the thicker straps in the back. They're so soft, so airy and lightweight. You just feel so good in them. I don't know any other way to explain it. They have like a barely there feeling to them. I have these ones in a few colors as well. This is one that's one of those rare cases that I do size down to a size extra extra small. And the reason being for that is because of this fabric. It's just like beyond stretchy, like way more stretchy than the cotton fabric one. So I do like to size down in it, but I'm sure if you went with your true to size size, it would work too. Next up is the boy shorts. I have this one in a couple of colors as well. These are obviously the same amazing fabric. They are so lightweight. They are obviously so stretchy and they're really roomy too, especially in the leg cutout area. They are high rise and they really cinch in at your waist. They obviously have really good coverage since they are boy shorts. But what I honestly love about them is that it doesn't feel like I'm wearing granny panties either. They mention that with this underwear the lighter colors are a little bit more see-through in the back but again this is underwear so it's not that big of a deal but just figured i would mention it this is a great pair to wear with skirts or jeans if you don't want to see panty lines but you also don't want to wear a thong either i would definitely highly recommend these next up is the slip dress everybody needs a slip dress in their wardrobe this is a necessity this doesn't replace shapewear by any means but i feel like it really holds me in and conforms to my body it doesn't write up it really just stays in place. It is a good length for me for being petite, but this is definitely one that you could pull down or pull up. Works for those ladies that are taller than me. I wouldn't say that the black is see-through either, but it's kind of on edge. And I feel like this is a dress that I would wear by itself. I wouldn't confine it to just strictly an undergarment. I definitely would pair it with like an oversized zip up, some sneakers, or maybe if you want to dress it up, I think a leather jacket and some heels would look so good with this too. So next up is the square neck bottom bodysuits. I love that they started coming out with bodysuits and t-shirts in the Fits Everybody collection. These are just like the same softness as all of the undergarments of like the bralettes and the thongs, but they made it into clothing too. So as you can see, this is a square neckline to it and the back of it has like a really low scoop to it. It is a thong bodysuit with a snap closure and this hits pretty much like at my hips. It's like a really good length on it. So if you wear high-waisted items, it's definitely not gonna be a problem at all. This is double lined, which is really good, but because of like this neckline and how far out the sides go, this isn't a bodysuit that I can wear a bra or bralette underneath. So just a heads up there. This bodysuit just makes me feel so sexy. It's such a flattering fit to it. I feel like I can pair it with absolutely anything, with jeans, shorts. It could be a base layer too if I wanna throw a shirt jacket or a blazer or something over top as well. I should mention that this is not shapewear, so it's not meant to like, like really suck you in but with this fabric it naturally just kind of holds and compresses you in a little bit but it is also really really stretchy and flexible and then for the very last bodysuit I also picked up recently the high neck version too in this gorgeous color. You guys know me and high necklines kind of just like this mock neck too. I'm just so obsessed with like the coverage of it, especially the cut on the front of this. I just feel like it's so flattering. It really just elevates just like a basic bodysuit. It makes you feel so sexy in it. I personally prefer to wear this one without a bra and that's really easy to do too because it's really compressive and supportive. It really just blows my mind that the fabric is fine, but it just holds up. It's not sheer either very form-fitting it doesn't bunch anywhere and of course like the other one this is a thong bodysuit so it has a snap closure on it hits right at the hips really good length on it and just like the last bodysuit this is definitely one that you can dress up or down I think it would look really good with sweatpants or jean jean shorts throw on a blazer if you want to wear trousers too and maybe some sneakers that would be a really cute outfit all right well that was my entire skims collection 
Wow, I cannot believe how many pieces that was. I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please make sure that you're giving it a thumbs up. As I always do, every single item will be listed down below in the description. The exact color, the sizing that I get and everything, and of course, links to it all. My measurements are always down there too as a reference for you guys. Also, let me know in the comments what items from Skims are your favorite or if there's any items on your wish list too. Before you go, please make sure that you're subscribed and also follow me over on Instagram at I am Carissa Renee. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day and I'll see you in a couple of days in my next video. Bye guys. I love you. Mm -hmm.